Hey guys, VVs, and welcome back to another video. And I'm sorry, I'm here again at Divination. I know you guys don't like watching Divination. Well, no one's saying in the comments that they don't like watching Divination, but I don't like watching Divination, but it needs to be done. Um, I should be mining now, but to be honest, I just wanted to show off my two, uh, 20,000 lustrous energies. I bought them from the GE. Um, I don't really know how much they were, and I don't really care, <laughs> to be honest. I just bought them because I'm sick of using the middle option at Divination, and it just gives me no XP at all. <clears throat> So I've just got back from my uh, first ever job job interview. It was at a place called The Noodle Box. Um, some of you Australians may be familiar, um, but it's basically, it's about 15 minutes away and they pretty much make noodles, put them in boxes and sell them. So that's always good. Nice first uh, first ever interview I've been done with and it was quite successful. I managed to get the job, fortunately. But the last few days have been uh, pretty exciting for me. I actually went out with one of my friends and we went on a uh, on his boat and we went out to uh, South Stradbroke Island, which is a place in Australia, obviously. Um, and what we did was we basically we drove or fl I don't what is it driving on the water I don't know friggin sailed let's let's say sailed with a motor we sailed with a motor to a little island and we basically chilled there set up some chairs and um, pretty much just chill banged um, now there was like when when we arrived there we kind of jumped into the water and we basically got the shore got the um, got the boat all anchored up and such, tied it to a tree and threw an anchor in so it didn't move away. And the tide came in all that good stuff and there was like a little rope swing there. So basically this rope was tied up to this tree and it was like dangling down with a with a log, like a little like a little log attached attached to the end that you could hold on. So there was like a smaller one and then there was a massive one higher up in the tree. And the smaller one was absolutely useless. You basically get on it, you swing it, you fall straight in the water and it's just no fun at all. So what I did was I wanted to get the big one up at the um up at the top of the tree because it was like wrapped around the tree a little bit. Um, it was just it was just a little bit wrapped around. To get it off, what I needed to do was um, I needed to get the little log off of the smaller off of the smaller tree off the smaller rope swing. Sorry, attach it to the bigger one and then throw it around some branches and stuff. And I'm nearly about to level up here. I've got 1.4k XP. So let's look out for the level up here. 72 72 divination. Let's go, son. And I'm also 772k XP off 96 mining. But I digress again. On back onto the main topic. So basically, I needed to attach this smaller log to the bigger one so I could throw it, throw it over a branch and then use the bigger one. So what I did was, I got the smaller log and I um, I got it out a little hole from the bottom rope and attached it to the bigger one. I could just reach it. I was on my like I was on my tippy toes. I was climbing up in the tree and I was on my tippy toes and I to managed to attach it. And now was the now the next bit was pretty much the most difficult bit. Um, so what I needed to do was I needed to get the log and put it behind my head and like throw it over the branch. So it was like I needed some leverage and stuff, but it was the rope was so far extended down the tree that I had no leverage at all. So I basically imagine get your hand out, put it out. Imagine you grabbed a tennis racket, turned it over and threw it like backwards, like facing the sky. But yeah, I managed to throw the tree up. I missed it the first few times and it just came back and nearly hit me in the head three times. Luckily, it was attached to the rope or I would have been dead. Not really, but anyway, so I threw it back. Oh, hold up, I got into rich. This guy's saying a rich. What a champion, son. So I threw it backwards. It's the third time I've said that now, fourth time. So I threw it back, and um, it didn't actually get the tree. It actually went in between these other branches, uh, which were actually situated behind me. So I had to climb back up the tree, get the log down, and then I was back at square one. So now I'm back at square one. I basically got the log and tried to throw it again, but it managed to get stuck in another friggin' a fork tree just to the right of it. So that wasn't any good. And here we go. Bang! 72 divination, 93k XP to level up. That's a, oh my gosh, that's a lot of XP um, in divination. So um, screw my life. But yeah, so this, so this log is now stuck up in this tree to the right, which is absolutely ridiculous because I'm trying my butt off to get it out. So I tried to get it out of that one. I threw it again. Um, one of my mates told me to like throw it the opposite direction. So the momentum will take it. Um, we'll take the strain of the rope and I'll end up going, oh shit, I just hit my fan off the desk. Um, so basically, cause I'm like swinging my arms around while I'm commentating. That would be nice to uh, see on the, on the video. But yeah, so I'm like, I swinged it around and the momentum took the rope strain and like went around and then it got hooked up again. So the tree is about 15 feet off the ground, stuck in a, um, stuck in a tree right now. And it was funny because me and my mate and my mate's brother, we were like, we were throwing this little tennis ball thing 
um, back and forth while it was high tide, pretending we were in part of the Australian cricket team and catching it and stuff. What's unfortunate about the uh, English cricketers right now, I'm sorry if you're watching, but is that 5-0 at the Ashes? But anyway, we're pretending that we're like, we're pretending we're Australian cricketers because they just absolutely demolished England right now. Um, and we're like doing these dives and stuff and there's these, this group of three little kids came along and they were like, they were just swimming through the water and they were saying stuff like, um, you know, oh, I swear that there was a rope swing here because they obviously knew that, um, that, the rope swingers there, and they normally come there at high tide, I'm guessing, and it was unfortunate that some um, some idiot actually got rid of the rope swing up, and it got stuck in the tree, I don't know how that happened, but, um, so I'm pretty sure I ruined those kids' day. That's basically what I've been doing the past few days, I just did that, and um, I did a few other things, can't really remember, but I'd had my job, job interview this morning, managed to get a job, so unfortunately less XP for me, but more gains, Irrel. Um, but uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this commentary. If you did, please sure, be sure to subscribe and like it for more. And I will see you in the next video. My mining XP each day to see how much mining XP I obviously get each day. And that just assists me with tracking uh, my XP, uh, obviously. And it, will, it can kind of give me some sort of indication of when I'll be able to get the uh, 99 mining. So obviously yesterday I was 94 mining and currently 700.